girl Gladys aka is that your hair and welcome back to my channel if you're new to my channel welcome I'm so happy to have you here make sure you tap that subscribe button and hit the notification bell and if you've been rocking with me for a minute what's up what's good and welcome back all right y'all so I'm here with a unit from Bobby Boss now before we dive in I just want to let you know that this is my 10k giveaway video so if you want to see the giveaway details, make sure you watch until the end to get that information. All right, y'all, let's dive in. This is Bobby Boss Camille, and she is from Bobby Boss's latest Ghoulist HD line. Bobby Boss Camille does have 13 by four parting. It is a 360 lace unit, so there is lace all around the perimeter of the unit, even in the back. It does come with HD transparent lace. It has a custom plucked natural hairline. There are baby hairs for added realism. The cap comes with an elastic band and this is heat safe up to about 360, 400 degrees. This is Camille right here. You see her? And I have her in the 1B color. Let me just give you a quick 360 of Camille. All right, y'all, let's get into my thoughts on Miss Camille, starting with the pros. So straight out the pack, first pro to this unit is the style. These like deep wave curls are absolutely gorgeous. Wow, y'all see that? And I love that the curl is consistent throughout the unit. I know I experience that sometimes with synthetic wigs where, especially with wigs that are more of a barrel curl, sometimes they'll go different directions or it won't be all the way down the hair shaft or throughout the unit. But this is doing a deep wave all over and I love it. The length, however, is a bit long. <laughs> I'm like, it goes past, hold on. Like this is the length on me, you guys. I'm 5'3 and it is hitting me like a good 28 inches. <laughs> Jeez Louise, down to my butt. Yeah, that's some stripper hair. So yes, Camille is extremely long on me. I would definitely cut her around to maybe, probably around the top of my breast here, which would be more like 20 inches. I know Brittany, AKA the Hearts and Cake 90, when she reviewed Camille, she did that. It looks really lovely on her. Another pro to this unit is the hairline. As you can see, it's definitely pre-tweezed. I could have tweezed it some more, but honestly, I was so, Worried about disturbing the curls in this unit. I just left it alone. I'm totally fine with how the hairline looks. And I got a little swoop over there. Y'all know I don't do baby hairs, but it kind of just laid like that. And I was like, okay, I got a little baby hair. <laughs> now for those who like to style their units, this is a 13 by four frontal, which I do think gives you ample space to do some type of styling, whether you want to do half a half down, maybe you want to corn roll it. I think this unit would be great for that. Now as a 360 unit, I've never tried to put up a synthetic wig and wear it outside. <laughs> so I wasn't about to do it now. It just seems like it would take a lot of work. I'm totally happy with how it looks like this. 
But if you want to try that, it's supposed to be an option. As far as the texture, I would say it's a pro. It feels nice. I think this is mimicking human hair pretty well for it to be a purely synthetic wig. I would say it's a light yakky texture. And yeah, I like the way the curls feel. They feel good. Now let's get into the cons of this unit. I've mentioned this before, but the HD lace is just a struggle for me. I was struggling off the camera. I was just like, what the... <laughs> what am I doing? What am I doing? I managed to get the lace to look decent and I'm proud of myself for that, but it was a lot. And I've talked about this already. I, I reviewed Body Boss Kava. I talked about it in that review. Body Boss Jacintha. Y'all saw me using all them products just to get it to blend. What are the products I used? One, two, three, four. Five. I use like five different things. And now I'm here with Body Boss Camille. Same thing. I mean, it's just what it is. Like that's what the HD lace is. On these units, it's white and I'm brown as fuck. So I just have to adjust. That's why I haven't reviewed Camille. I've had her for like two months and she's just been sitting there because I knew the work she would take to blend her. I just wasn't looking forward to it. But after I saw Britney's review, I was like, oh man, but she's so pretty. Let me bring her out. So here I am. Another con to me is like the cap. I feel like Bobby Boss is known for having a smaller cap, but also they just never, like I feel like it always cuts off around here. You see what I'm saying? Like why, why does it do that? It always does that and my edges are just exposed. If this is supposed to be a 360 wig, wh what am I doing? How am I gonna wear it as a 360? Like if you wanted to, to put this up and show this part, you would literally have to fill this in with some type of like black liner and like gel your hairs if your hairs are really kinky like mine to make it blend. Otherwise, no. <laughs> so yeah, I don't know about that. Also the elastic band, uh, why is it there? It's not doing anything for me. You claim that this wig is glueless. It's not. We know we gotta glue it down with some type of adhesive, whether it be a gel or an actual glue, so later for that. But here Body Boss is highlighting on the spot card, glueless. Why y'all lying? Why y'all lying? But you know what? Despite those cons, I think Camille is absolutely stunning. She looks damn good. I can't believe I have nowhere to go in this hair. Yes. Girl, I love these curls. That's one thing I love about synthetic wigs. It comes styled for you, so if you are a person who doesn't know how to style hair, or if you're lazy like I can be sometimes, you have a synthetic wig, it comes styled like this, and you don't have to worry about the curls dropping necessarily like it would on a human hair wig and having to recurl it. For the most part, it's going to stay in this style as long as you store it properly, put it on a mannequin head, etc. So I just, I love that. I absolutely love that. Now one more thing, let's talk about the price. This unit is definitely <laughs> Like, I've definitely seen it for like $60. So after recording this video, I actually looked up how much Body Boss Camille costs. And she's actually like $62, $69. Some website had it for $70. Oh my goodness. She is definitely expensive for a synthetic wig that's not a human hair blend. And this is in a natural color. That is definitely pricey for a synthetic wig. And for it to not be a human hair blend, I'm just like... Uh, I did talk about that in my video with the featuring the Butter One unit and just saying higher price synthetic wigs. I feel like there should be some type of human hair blend option. I'm not saying all of them have to be a human hair blend, but I feel like more of them should be. This feels really nice though. Like whatever synthetic hair fibers they use is definitely of a higher quality, but for $60 or more, if you get a color, yeah, I don't know about that. I can tell y'all right now, I'm not feeling it. It's a con. My mind is teetering because I'm looking at myself and I'm like, wow, have I seen this style on another synthetic wig? Of course you have. Actually, similar. I did review a wig for $20 Tuesday, like months ago. It was It's a Wig. It was by It's a Wig. The curl pattern is somewhat similar to Camille, a tad bit looser, but still within that deep wave family. So if you want to check out that review, I'll link it in the description box down below if you want like a cheaper alternative. Of course, you're not getting 13 by 4 parting space and you know, it's a middle part kind of wig, I believe. I didn't try shifting it to the side, but I think it's still a nice alternative if you don't want to pay 60 something dollars for this type of deep wave. All in all, I'm really feeling Camille. I think she's super pretty and you know, I don't feel like I wasted my money because I bought this myself so 
I'm happy with this purchase. I think whenever I do decide to wear her out, I will just cut her a bit um, to about the 20 inch mark and then I'll be good to go. I did want to try putting her in a half up half down style. This looks so pretty though. I'm so scared to move the curls y'all. Oh, it looks gorgeous. Like look at this. Oh, bitch. Do you see me? <laughs> <laughs> this looks good. Should I do it? Should I do it? Oh, she looks so cute. Maybe I should try her in the middle. What do you guys think? <sighs> Don't disturb the curls, Gladys. Oh my God, this is Camille in the middle. She is a cutie. <laughs> yes. Hi. Look at me looking like a doll, baby. I look like a freaking porcelain doll. Yeah, she's pretty, y'all. I should try half, half, half down, right? Fuck it. I'ma do it. I'ma do it. Oh my God. This is freaking gorgeous. Wow, Camille. All right, half, half, half down. All right, y'all. This is how Camille's looking half up, half down. I'm, I'm over here trying not to disturb the curl pattern. Let me know what you think about her style this way. Do you prefer her this way? Or do you prefer her just all the way down to the side like I had her? Let me know. This is cute. This is cute. All right, y'all, so let's get into the giveaway. 10K giveaway, very simple, very easy. I'm gonna give away two prizes, okay? One per person, so there will be two winners. The first winner, will win money because i feel like during this time you know not everyone has the luxury of working from home some people are waiting on a paycheck some people have no income coming in whatsoever so you know i think giving away some money would be great so i'm going to give away 50 dollars via cash app to the first winner and the second winner will get a wig of their choice from me the price is at 50 dollars, so it can be any wig you want up until $50. Now here are the rules of the giveaway. One, you must be subscribed to my channel. Two, you must be following me on Instagram at is that Troy Hair. Literally the same name as my YouTube channel. And three, I want you to comment down below your Instagram handle so I know that to check to see if you're following me. And also comment down below what you like about my channel and one thing you want to see on my channel. It could be anything, it could be makeup, it could be story time, it could be some type of talk through, just anything you want. Tell me what you want that to be. I think the rules are very simple. Of course, if you're interested in this giveaway, the rules are right here. Watch the video so that you know what you have to do. And yeah, I look forward to seeing everybody participate and I'm looking forward to giving away some money and a wig. Because girl, who doesn't want a little extra cash and who doesn't like a new wig? <laughs> So yes, y'all, that's the giveaway. The giveaway will close Friday, May 8th. So make sure, you know, tell a friend, tell a friend, like, share this video. And if you are new here and you have not subscribed yet, what are you waiting for? Tap that subscribe button, hit the notification bell so that you don't miss any of my upcoming videos. I'm so thankful to have made it to this point of reaching 10K and beyond. I can't wait for the next 10K and the next 10K. I just wanna keep it going. Of course, this will not happen without all of you. So to everyone who comments and watches and shares and likes and reposts. My goodness, you don't know how much that means to me. Thank you from the bottom of my heart, seriously. If you wanna check out some of my latest videos, you can see them over here to the right of me. Thank you all so much for watching and I will see you in the next video. Bye.